I'm Ray Tanzen. With the UC Surface 1.5 update, we've introduced a new stage box mode and new networking settings to provide a more robust audio network. In this video, I'll explain the new features and show you how to set up stage box mode for your RM mixer. Before you begin, always make sure your firmware is up to date on both mixers and you have an AVB option card installed on the AI console mixer. The RM mixers ship with the AVB card already installed. Studio Live RM mixers can be used as a stage box and monitor mixer with a Studio Live AI console mixer. This is done with AVB audio networking. There are two stage box modes supported with this system. The first is simple stage box mode. In this mode, the RM mixer acts as a simple stage box, providing inputs to the AI console mixer at front of house and outputting the main mix and AUGS mixes from the front of house mixer to the RM mixer's main and mix outputs. In this mode, the RM mixer's DSP is bypassed and it functions as a traditional digital snake. The second mode is for remote I.O. and monitor mixing. When set to this mode, the RM mixer will provide remote inputs to the AI console mixer at front of house and the main mix from the front of house mixer will be sent to the RM mixer's main outputs. The mix outputs on the RM mixer provide dedicated AUGS outputs from the RM mixer, allowing it to be used as a separate monitor mixer. There are two ways to configure your network for using the RM mixer as a stage box. You can do a direct connection with a single Ethernet cable going between the RM mixer and the AI console mixer, or you can connect them using an AVB switch. Using an AVB switch is the recommended method if you'd like to also connect a router for using wired or wireless control devices, such as an iPad or computer running UC Surface, or iPhones running QMix. With a direct connection, you'll need to configure both the RM mixer and the AI console mixer to use a static self-assigned IP address. Please refer to our setting up Studio Live AI and RM networking video. Then, simply connect the two mixers with a single Ethernet cable. When using an AVB switch and a router, you can leave the RM mixer and AI console mixer in the default dynamic IP address mode. With this configuration, connect both mixers to the AVB switch. Also, connect the router to the AVB switch using one of the router's local area network or LAN ports, not the wide area network or WAN internet port. Any wired control devices, such as a computer, can be connected to either the AVB switch or the router LAN ports. Wireless control devices will connect to the router's wireless access point. Once everything is connected and powered on, you can turn on stage box mode from the AI console mixer. Press the System button and page down to the Network Stage Box page. This page contains the Connected Mixer option, Stage Box On-Off option, and Stage Box Mode option. If an RM mixer is not already selected as the Connected Mixer, use the Value Encoder to scroll to the desired mixer, and press Store to connect to the selected mixer. Press the Next button to move the cursor to the Stage Box On-Off option and enable Stage Box Mode. By default, it will enter Remote I.O. plus Monitor Mixer Mode. To change the mode to the Simple Stage Box Mode, press the Next button to move the cursor to the Stage Box Mode option and use the Value Encoder to scroll to Stage Box. Your RM mixer is now set up to be used as a stage box for your AI console mixer at front of house. Every time you boot up the system, it will remember these settings until you turn off stage box mode. Be sure to check out our other videos to learn more about the Studio Live AI and RM mixing systems.